Well, parents in Bibb County are at a public hearing to talk about the next school year's proposed budget. It's an issue at the center of a lot of controversy over how to get the system's financial house in order. 41 NBC's Tucker Sargent's there right now. He joins us live with more. Tucker. Guys, this is the budget this, the district has struggled to come up with over the last six months, especially with all the changes that have been brought forth in this budget. Now, the school board under interim superintendent Steve Smith has to address an $18.7 million budget sh uh, deficit shortfall. And, uh, of course, everybody is, is on the same page as that needs to be fixed. But it's the question of how uh, that's raising more questions right now. And the board is set to final approve the budget a week from tonight. But tonight here is a public hearing. Now, right now, only a handful of people are here of three or four people actually are the only uh, people here to speak out their thoughts on this budget but you still have time to come out tonight that's what the, these public hearings are set up for so you can voice your opinion on what you'd like and don't like about the budget but again only three or four people are here right now so you need, really need to come out and voice your opinion of course some parents may be waiting for later on this week tomorrow and thursday the interim superintendent will be holding uh, listening sessions to get feedback from the community over at central high school i'll have the dates and uh, actual times of those meetings uh, later on the night, later on tonight on the news at 10 and 11, and I'll also post those times for you on our website at 41NBC.com. I'm going to go inside here and check out what these three or four citizens have to say about this budget. Remember, a tentative budget was approved last week. Now they're just giving the public a chance to voice their opinions, and of course, final adoption on this budget is set for next week. Stay with us for the latest on this budget. For now, I'm reporting live in downtown Macon. Tucker Sargent, 41NBC News.